Okay, I'm bored. You're bored. Let's get this over with. That's a left off deck. Go just watching on Ida and Bago arguing because Bago is still Bago despite his attitude change. Okay, let's get to it. Bago sees that as Deku and just promptly tries to act all cool and whatever just to get Deku's attention. Remember, he he does feel bad for him. All he's done to Deku, and he's trying to get back in Deku's good graces. Ida just walks up to Deku, you know, just trying to be all friendly, which Deku reciprocates this and gives Ida a fist bump. Which is like, huh, maybe I should be so stiff. Oh, I know what I said. Don't you dare. Oh, God. <laughs> anyway, sooner or later, a rocket shows up and she, when she sees Deku in his desk, which they have made specifically for him. Yeah, she she runs up and actually hugs him, or at least his arm. I wish me and Pony and Jiro was like, uh, what's this about? Deku's like, um, I have no idea. I have nothing to do with this. Like, oh, really? Like, don't you remember what happened last time? It's like, it, you're my first. And everyone hears this. It's like, Mina, Pony, and Joe are just fuming with anger and rage. It's like, you're, you're first. Care to explain yourself, boy? It's like, I. <clears throat> uh, I, I, um, just, just speak up. You, you shouldn't mumble. It's, it's bad manners. I, <clears throat> okay, uh, yeah, but when I was taking her home that time, yeah, <laughs> she, uh, she kissed me on the cheek. What? Oh, Rocco, she has this devilish smile, just like, oh, yeah, I did that. I got to him first, so y'all could shove it up your asses. Yeah, she has. She, she's just glaring at them, just like acting like that. So, oh, oh yeah, this this gravity bitch wanna die. Like, Jacky's just like, hold, hold it, no, 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 no one needs to die here. So, uh, then as I was just trying to say, y'all need to shut up, shut the fuck up. I'm trying to sleep, and y'all ruining my beauty rest. Look at me. I need my beauty rest more than anyone, any one of you. We're sorry. Or I could just sit next to Deku, just looking all smug, and Deku's like, woman, you almost got Do you want to get yourself killed? Uh, it was, yeah, she's like, yeah, they're not going to be, they're not going to hurt me. It's like, what? Because you're going to protect me, aren't you? Like, like a good boy. He's like, ah, like a hero. Oh, hell. Yeah, she's got me pegged. I wish, yeah, she, yeah, the others are not amused about this. They, they are pissed. They, they want vengeance. They want to kill a rocket, but they know they can't. Because they know how Deku is. He would not allow it. But hell, wank. But yeah, you know the whole quirk assessment. As soon as we get to the locker room, everyone sees how built Deku is. And Kirishina just walk, walks up saying, Dude, did, did you go... Did you, did you get even taller? It's like, um, I, I hope not, because... The school can't keep accommodating for my size anymore. So, dude, you, you've got to, you have to reach your peak sooner or later. So, I have no idea if I ever will. He knows how tall Kaido is, so he's like, <sighs> I'm looking forward to all the renovations I'm going to do at home when I get that old. And then he notices Mineta being a creep and probably just like, what are you doing, little boy? Like, um, 
Oh, who am I kidding? You're not stupid. I'm about to peep on the girls. I'm like, uh, yeah, I can't let you do that. Like, Dude, I found this. Th this was a gift from from our upperclassmen. They wanted us to look. They wanted us to enjoy such pleasures. Like, yeah. The only thing that's waiting for you on the other side of that is pure hell. Trust me. You have to trust me here. It's like, I really don't want to. Just let me get one peek. No, he grabs him by the neck and just tosses him into the wall. Actually, denting it. Man is actually imprinted on. Has an imprint on the wall. Jiro, she's been listening and then she, she's like, huh. He, she relays all the information to the girls, which, like, thank you, Izuku. Thank you so much. But then, yeah, she, she uh, still listening, uh, gets curious, because she did hear what Kirishima said. Like, let, let, me, let me see what uh, our buddy Izuku is working with. Yeah, when she sees him, she's like, Ooh. Seriously, I wish I had some singles to throw at him and see him. See what else I can, can get. Like, oh, <laughs> oh, seriously, yeah, she's like, uh, well, I need some singles. Let's see how, how far he'll go for some money. So, she says this out loud accidentally, which causes the other girls to actually jump her ass. Yeah, especially when they see her bloody nose. She's like, I wish they're about to look too after being down Jiro, but then they notice, like, Deku's like, oh, uh, yeah, I better fix this hole. In which he actually melts one of the tiles. Which they're just like, are you serious? Not only was he kind enough to take care of the pervert and not peep at us, but he he got rid of, he got rid of the people all together. But then they're just looking at Joe's like, thinking, but she got to see what, what he's working with, didn't she? Which gets them even more mad. Like, you know what? What we did before isn't enough. We, we, need to, we need to do that again. But then as I just says, hurry the fuck up. We got some shit to do. And you know how Deku is. He does you know, Deku is doing. I mean, he's, he gets first place in pretty much everything except for the ball throw. Hell, in the speed test, he actually creates storm clouds and has learned to actually travel through them in the lightning. Which, it was like, the fuck, man? How did you... Like, my quirk is storm dragon. Storm dragon. That lightning... He just some purple lightning. He's like, yeah, I can do. I can do some shit. <laughs> Kaminari's like, dude, can, uh, can can you can you train me or something? He's like, what? Um, really? Like, Hell yeah! If I had as much control as you do, could could you imagine how much? Uh, huh? Maybe after school. Yeah, I, I think I think that could work. Like, really? Sure, I see potential in you. you. I mean, the only real downside to your quirk is like, uh, what? You get tired or something? <sighs> no, I go stupid. In the words of a uh, a friend of mine, uh, Fallout, whatever, he turns into a retired Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't. oh okay yeah that's that's gonna be an issue hold on let me try something he uh some some lighting on his fingers like try this off for size just a little zap it and since car and i are flying almost through a wall like, uh, are, are you okay like, yeah like okay good like, um you can, uh, can you get out of there? Yeah. I was like, oh, perfect. Uh, come on, let's, let's go. I was like, yeah. I was like, um, what's two plus two? Yeah. What's zero plus zero? 
Yeah. Oh, damn it. <laughs> it was, hell, that was one of my lowest voltages. What the hell, man? Yeah. Oh, fuck you. Yeah. What? He's like, nope, nope, I am not dealing with this. He just, he just pulls a coming out of the I am not dealing with this shit. Not, not now. I was like, yeah, fuck you. Ugh. He just tossed the common to the locker room. I was like, oh man, this is going to be a lot of work for me, isn't it? Yeah. Who said that? Because he's out cold right now. I was like, Kirsten was like, I did. I was like, you ass. I was like, why did you do that? Because it was funny as hell. Well, you're an ass. So. Yeah. I'm going to end up killing you. So. Eh, maybe. But it'll be worth it. So. Oh, oh, whatever. And before he actually like, he leaves the locker room, he gets a call. Like, Hello? Hey, Zoo. Like, Toga, what's uh, going on? So. Oh, nothing. I just want to talk to you. Like, I'm um, seeing how, want to see how class was going. So, uh, it was interesting, to say the least. So, what do you want? So, I told you. I just want to want to talk to you. That's that's all. Yeah, I don't believe you. <laughs> you know me. So, yes, yes, I do. Because I know you crazy. Crazy? That, I am a psychopath, mind you. Yes, yes, I do. I, I do know you're, you're a psychopath. That's one of the re reasons I try my best not to uh, go crazy along with you. Huh. Fair point. Either way, some of my friends actually want to meet you, and I was wondering if you can make an appearance, you know, in um, dragon form. It's like, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Like, mm, no, I, I want them to see, see your dragon form. Like, <sighs> yeah, I can't do that. Like, but w why not? Because I refuse to do it. Okay. How about this? Either you do it, or I tell the girls about our little arrangement. What? Oh, yes. I'll tell Mina and Pony that I'm living with you. So what? Hell, they're, they're cool girls. They won't care. Uh, so, you're not doing it? Nope. And he hangs up. Well, Toby's like, Oh, you foolish, foolish, dense anime protagonist. And she calls me dumb pony. Like, oh, what is it, Toga? Oh, well, I got some things to share with you. And which, as soon as Deku actually arrives back in class, he's getting... Getting some death stares from Mina and Pony. And he's like, uh, okay. Whatever she said must have been very bad. And what she, she asked, she just saying, she's just thinking like, okay. What'd she say? Like, she told us how you two were living together. Is that true? Yes. Where she said you probably was true. So she was your first? Wait, what? Your first. Your first kiss and everything? It's like, oh, no. No, no, that, that is definitely not true. So like, just, just, here's just like, yeah, I'm, I'm his first kiss. Like, like, Turkey's like, damn it, woman. Like, what? I was like, Mina, Pony, and Jiro are just like, what? You can see the face of a demon just emanating from the bloodlust that they're creating. He's like, 
Deku's like, oh damn, this I did not expect this. Wait, hold on. Um, um, um seriously, uh, Toga, she was lying. She, we haven't done anything. She's just staying with me and my mom. That's all. Yes, and she told us all about that. How you share a bed. Uh, how you see each other in a shower. You take baths together. No, no, no that is a lie. That is a cool, that, that is a ugly lie. No, I did not. Like, huh, she's told us about a quirk. Like, yeah, so she explained in detail how she has to be naked specifically in order to really use it. Yeah, and so, yeah, you train with her, don't you? Yeah. So, sorry. Oh, no, 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 it's not like that whatsoever. I promise you, it's nothing like that. He, he just pulls out his phone and starts calling to it. Like, yes, yes, my beast kings. Like, <sighs> set, set the record straight. Tell them the truth. Like, and don't you dare try to lie. Um, give me what I want, and you have a deal. So, fine, I'll. Fine, fine, I'll. Fine, I'll do it. Like, Oh, really? I knew you would see it my way. Whatever you, you damn sadist. Like, thank you. Wait, hold on a second. Blood was <laughs> uh, Thanks, Blood. Thanks, Blood Wolf. Um, oh, now you're in the video, too. <laughs> that was seriously. I'm going to have to check out that comment and see which one he was talking about. In a way, yeah, Toga, she, she, he puts her on speakers like, okay, tell them the truth. So, okay, I may have lied about what happened. I mean, I am living with Izuku. That's not a lie. But as for him, him being my first and vice versa, yeah, that was obviously a lie. And if anything, when I met him, he seemed to have at least... Some experience when it comes to someone kissing him. So, like, what? Then they just look at a rock and say, Oh, yeah, you said you was his first kiss. Choke is like, Who? He's like, Deku. He's like, uh, what, what is this? Explain yourself. Well, you, you see, Toga. When I was taking Oraka home, she gave me a kiss on the cheek. So. Like, oh, that's it? Oh, in that case, never mind. Just, that doesn't count as a real kiss. Like, what? Like, yeah, that does not count as a kiss. That, that kiss is from, like, a child giving their parent a kiss. That's... That's something you would give your grandmother a kiss on the cheek. That's nothing. That's nothing compared to what I'm going to do to you. Like, what? Oh, yes, as soon as you get home? Yeah, you're mine. Since we live together, I have unfiltered access to you. And, yeah, he she's still on speaker, so everyone hears this. And it's like, oh, my God. God, I need to hang out with this guy more often. It's like, and Deku, he's just like, <sighs> Toga, like, yes, Izu, you're on speaker. Like, I don't care. I don't care who hears me. If anything, you should be worried about what I'm going to wear tonight. It's like, Toga. So help me, God! I am gonna gonna what? What, what are you gonna do? Seriously, you care you care too much about your subordinates. You wouldn't hurt me. But we'll see about that. Cause soon I do with you, yeah. Like, oh, don't tease me, Zeus. Like, no, that's a threat. It's like, 
Yes, but but it really ex excites me. What, what are you, masochist? That depending on who's who's doing it, maybe. If he just hangs up, he 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 can't he can't allow her to speak anymore. He's, he turns around and everyone's looking at him, and you know the girls are just like, okay, um, how do you want to die? What? Oh yes, you you are going to die. Y'all can't hurt me. Then Pony just takes out one of her horns and it goes straight through cutting Deku's cheeks like what? Then she was, before he actually returns to her he grabs it like wait a minute. These spikes. Wait. Did you did you fit out your horns and make spikes out of my scales? Oh, yes. You see, I wanted to have an edge over you. And this was the best way to do so. So, you turned your horns into something that could actually hurt me. Yep, by using your scales and at least turning them into spikes. Yeah. And now, I can hurt you. And me, you know, she just takes out a knife and says, like, and this pretty little thing is made from one of your scales as well. What? But I only gave you guys one scale. Unless you... Oh, fuck. Yep. They said the money we made, we were able to actually purchase your scales. And lo and behold... <laughs> yeah. So... You and us are going to have a talk. Kirishi is like, um, oh well, since, um, since they're just on the way to their weaponry. He's like, Kirishi, but don't tell me you too. He's like, yeah, Izuku, uh, knowing how strong you are compared to how my harning is. Yeah, I need an edge. So, yeah, I made gauntlets and boots out of your scales that I bought. Dude! Yeah, sorry, Izuku. Yeah, we're pretty much fitted to beat you down now. So, you would use me against me? Yeah, pretty much. Then I was like, wait, use him? She looks at this, uh, looks at their weapons. Is like, wait, the, the, those were made from your scales. Dick's like, yeah. So you're, you're the cause of all this sudden increase and in super strong, sturdy hero gear and stuff like that, and the clothing. It's made from the fur when I'm in my dragon form. So, whenever my family buys something from the store, like, wait, what are you talking about? Yeah, my family is probably one of your best customers. Wait, my best. You're a Yayu Rozu? Correct. Oh. Oh, dear. Like, the girls are like, so, so what? So, well, not only do they buy my products, they are also field testers. So... Yeah, we just made a whole new line of underwear and lingerie. It's like, what? Yeah, it's supposed to be super durable so that even during a villain attack, you can still look sexy. Like, 
excuse me? And I was like, actually, yeah, it's very comfortable. Just check it out. Yeah, she just shows it. She just, this memo is going to be bolder, you could say. I think it fits, considering how she has to pretty much flash someone whenever she, whenever she's uh, making something too that's too big. She's yeah, she she shows them the whole pattern and everything. She's, everyone's like, I mean, they're thinking, wait, so you're pretty much wearing him? It's like, is it really that comfortable? Let me feel too. It's like, Jake is like, I'm going to electrocute you, little man, if you try any bullshit. Meanwhile, Bongo's like. Oh man, I really fucked up. This 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 dude is gonna I'm never gonna be no more hero as long as he's around. I don't have to sell for second place. Which everyone she, they're just thinking like what the hell? They they're making underwear from, from this guy, armor, weapons. This is fucking weird. As I was thinking what did we just allow into this class? And anyway, the bell rings. And one was just walking home. And just, Kirishima and the girls was like, just like, yeah, we're not done here. Yeah, we are. Then, then Jiro and El Raka just show us like, so what's this about this girl living with you? Uh, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't stay. I got somewhere to be. <sighs> it may be a good reason. You're just leaving us high and dry. And, uh, yeah, you can say it's a good reason. Jacob transforms to his dragon form and just flies off. Meeting Toga and her friends. Which as soon as they see Dega, they they're thinking about running away, but but they stop as soon as they see Toga with a big ass grin on her face. Like, wait, well, why aren't you running? Like, because this is our ride home. That's Izuku. You're friends with a dragon? Which stick is like dragon. Yes, I am a dragon, so so what? Izuku, stop joking around. Just change back. As soon as he does, they like, whoa, that's interesting. Toga's like, yes, this is this is my guy right here. This, this he is mine. And I'm and I'm his his main woman. What? Deku's like, Nani? Yes. Agree with me or else? I can make it so much more worse. Like, uh, yeah. Uh, she's right. Huh. To be honest, Toga, we thought you were going crazy when you told us about Izuku, but yeah, you were... You are not lying whatsoever. Of course I wasn't lying. Why, who would lie about something like this? Especially if I couldn't prove it. Like, give me a second. But yes, you see? He's mine. But I am willing to share him with some other girls that he does know. Like, he's like... Share me? Seriously, you you are really crazy, aren't you? Toga just scowls at him like, which I love so much about you. I mean, seriously, crazy is sexy nowadays. Like, yeah, I know, right? Her friends are just thinking, huh? Yeah, I'm a, uh, I'm a little skeptical of y'all relationship. Won't, why don't you prove it? So, what? Yeah, I won't, we want you to prove it. Toga's like, okay. She she just hops on 
<laughs> on Deku and just kisses him. Open mouth kisses him. It's like, Deku's eyes are wide as hell. They're like, like is this really happening? And so, let's say it takes two minutes. They're, they're, they're kissing for two minutes. And the toga is like, that's a real kiss. That peg on the cheek is nothing. Deku is speechless. Her friends are speechless. She's like, yep, that's that's Toga, all right. She's like, yeah. Um, y- y'all wanted me to take you home, didn't you? He's like, y- yeah, please. Because God knows what she's going to try next if we ask her to prove it again. So, yeah. He turns one to a dragon and just sends her, fr- takes her friends home. So, as soon as the as soon as uh, Toga and Deku arrive back at his place, he's like, Toga, why'd you have to do that? He's like, do what? Um, kiss you? Well, yeah, that, but why'd you have to say that I was your your man? He's like, because you are. Like, what? Yes, I've claimed you. I will be your first wife, your main wife. The others, yeah. I'll, I'm happy with sharing, but... First, yeah, you're you're mine. No, no, no ifs, ands, or buts. You are mine. Uh, um. Oh hell. In fact, I want two kids once we're married. Watch, like, yeah, I want two kids once we're married. Unless you want to get to work on that now. It's like, <sighs> no, no. Oh please no! If because if they either have my powers, but your craziness, God knows what could happen. Uh, what's the worst thing that could happen? So, Deku looking in the sky. He's like, are, "Are you enjoying this, Master?" Kyle is laughing his his ass off, just drinking as much as he can to to Deku's life. It's like this. This is awesome. I'm, I'm loving this. This this is better than cable TV. How about the deck? He's like, okay, whatever. I'm I'm going to bed, man. I I can't. It's been a long day, man. Don't worry, it'll get easier. What? Yeah, you'll get used to me soon enough. That's what I'm worried about. And they go head off to bed. And that is actually what I'm going to end this off. But yeah, that that was that was entertaining for me. It was it was hard for me to not laugh at least once. But seriously, Toga, I could see her doing something like that, couldn't you? Hell yeah, I could definitely see that. Anyway, I am out. Peace and love, children.